Marge Brown. I am a diamond coach with Team Beachbody. Welcome back to my kitchen in Leland, North Carolina. Today it's really hot in Leland. We had a tropical storm come through yesterday, so I thought, oh, it would be a great day to make something cold for dessert. So we're going to make chocolate mocha mousse today, and it is uh, going to use the key ingredient of chocolate shakeology. This is the shake that's the healthiest meal of the day and you can use this chocolate powder in numerous recipes so I can't wait to show you how we're going to make chocolate mocha mousse. Okay. We have just five ingredients for chocolate mocha mousse. Uh, the first, as I mentioned, is our Shakeology powder. And this recipe calls for one scoop of Shakeology. And this is the scoop that comes in the 30-day bag. So I already measured it into this bowl. And this is a, a daily serving packet. I just wanted to show you that. OK, the second ingredient is a quarter of a cup of almond milk. And if you don't drink almond milk. I highly recommend it. It's very healthy and it, it works great in a lot of recipes. Okay, the third ingredient is tofu. And I have to share that I have never cooked anything with tofu before. In fact, I just found out that tofu is coagulated soy milk and it was uh, handed down from ancient China. It's high in iron has uh, lots of vitamins and is used in a variety of sweet and savory cooking. So we're going to try tofu today. The fourth ingredient is a tablespoon of almond butter and this is going to make it really yummy. And last but not least I have a few ground up almonds and I'm going to put these on the top of the mousse when it's processed. So those are our ingredients, and I recommend getting everything ready in advance. Okay, this recipe is going to be really easy to make because everything goes in the food processor and then you run it for 90 seconds. So first I'm going to put in the quarter of a cup of almond milk. There it goes. Then I'm going to add the four ounces of softened tofu to the milk. Done. Now the scoop of our chocolate shakeology powder. For all you mousse lovers out there, this is what is going to make it delectable. Here is our tablespoon of almond butter. So that's going to go in the processor. The only ingredient that doesn't go in the processor would be the ground almonds because they're going to go on top of our serving dishes. Okay, everything's in there. So you don't even have to mix it. You just put the top on and hopefully this will work. When I hit on, it's going to run for 90 seconds. Here we go. The 90 seconds are up. I'm going to take the lid off and check out the mousse. Oh, and it looks perfect. It's just like a chocolate pudding consistency. And I can't imagine having a nicer dessert on a hot day like today because you definitely don't want to have to turn on the oven. And it's extremely healthy. So we're going to put the mousse into our serving dishes. And I think I'm going to get at least three servings out of this. So Bruce and I can draw lots for the third serving. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to sprinkle each one with some ground almonds. Oh, that looks yummy. I think we'll probably grill some chicken for dinner, so this will be a great dessert. Okay, now the last step, 
just involves covering each dish and placing it in the refrigerator for about an hour and your dessert is ready. So here we go. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed following this recipe for mocha mousse and you found even another reason to invest in your monthly supply of Shakeology and to share healthy meals with your family. Thank you for joining me. Okay, welcome back. Well, we've had our dinner and it's time for dessert, so let's see how our mousse came out. Oh, it's nice and chilled. I'm going to take a quick bite and I'll give you a quick report. There it is with the almond pieces on top. Mmm. That is a two thumbs up recipe. So I'd be happy to share it with you in writing. Just get in touch with me and you can have your own mocha mousse.